Alrighty, here we go. Has Chen been taken care of? Yeah, he's chilling out in the fridge right now. I planted the drugs and left him unconscious. In his Looks like he's uh, your friend should have no trouble. Got a weird guy likes to live in the fridge. I don't know why. Thank you. Just Dude, I got bad hands. You saved us, Mr. Chen. Money does not feel like enough thanks. How about a hand busy? But here's the plan. Hand busies. Hand busies. Will be satisfied with it. Satisfying a different way. Nah, two thousand dollars ain't bad. All that money, and I have nothing to spend it on. Okay, well, time to go to the hive. <laughs> this is like just—it's so fast if you know what you're doing. Just run there, run back. Not well, if you know what you're doing, ish. Like it's been a while since I've played this game. Uh, now I can go in the back door, or I can go through the front door because I do have the pass card, the membership. Uh, should be able to go left and get there. That's just neat. I think it's art. So, uh, if you couldn't read, this is the hive. Uh, so I can go through that front door. Or earlier when I got here, these guys were like, Oh man, you know, Billy knows where to get in, but Billy's a dick, he won't tell us. And then I moved a box, and it was a vent. To the shitter. And that's how you get in. And I'm in the hive. How does he get in without having to pay? Oh, I don't. Wow, it's 15 degrees out right now. The temperatures actually dropped like 15 Celsius degrees. Um, let's see. Off the top of my head, that's uh, 50. What's uh, 60, 60, 60, that's 57 Fahrenheit. Yeah, 57 Fahrenheit. I'm doing this all in my head. So leave me alone. But that's 57 Fahrenheit, which means the temperature has dropped like. 30 degrees in uh, Fahrenheit. What is... Oh, really? From the women? It's not even the men. It's, it's, uh, he's asleep. He is of no threat to me. He is the sleeping man. Anyone drop like a PDA? <laughs> for, oh, for one five, not oh, four, five, one though. Guess what I'm going to do? That's right, Billy. I'm going to hack this door and possibly get shot by that guy, which is why I'm saving. Okay, there we go. I don't even think this is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, shoot. Access grid. Nice. You're right, I do have elite skills. So now everyone here goes hostile. I don't even think I really need to do this. I th I'm positive I don't have to even come in here. I'm just doing it because I can. Uh, yeah. Instant detection. Just watch. Uh-huh. Wow, that is bad. Access granted. Oh my god, look at that! No! Oh. Threat detected, it even said. So this will uh, go to the main floor there. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Nope. See, I'm fine. You work here? Yeah. You could say that. That's a voice actor, which, like a part one. Boss. Oh! Really? Well, I'm sorry, Kwai. Mr. Tong Zi Hong sees no one today. Look, I didn't come halfway around the world to take no Aww. Do us both a favor and tell me where he is. Or what? 
You get mad and tear down a few walls with those instruments <laughs> of yours? This place isn't named the Hive for nothing. It's got plenty of work that's <laughs> come out of the panel. This is great. I like that. Hey, karaoke, you have night. Mr. Tom, do for you anything? I'm looking for someone. A cybersecurity specialist named Ari Van Bruggen. You know him? Never heard of him. What do you do? Steal your girl? Owe you money? He had a job go bad, and now he's on the run from the people who hired him. Huh. But you knew that already. Because a man like Mr. Tom doesn't hire idiots. And this <laughs> is the first place people like Van Bruggen come when they need help. So stop wasting my time and take me to Tong. I don't have the case argumentation, so if I have to talk to him, I do it. You're wasting my time. Uh huh. Van Bruggen is minor league player. Tong knows who he is. He just don't care. He's got bigger things to worry about. Huh. Uh, if Van Bruggen's not on your radar yet, then Tong is way behind. I can help catch up. Only if we have a pull permission. Uh. You expect me to fall for that? <laughs> Small timers don't attract this much attention. They don't have bell tower soldiers staking out their apartments. Van Bruggen's pissed off somebody big. And there's no way Tong's going to ignore that kind of development. Come on, do like the L.A. Noir style. Now your face gets all weird. Smarter than you look. Yeah. Tong is keeping a close eye on things. Like you said, he's no fool. If you haven't figured out, this is Tong I'm talking to. Van Bruggen is more than just a hacker, you know. He trained in counterintelligence. Really? He's got forged identities, secure bank accounts, and safe houses all over the world. Sounds like my kind of homie. He's already off this island, and I guarantee you never find him. I know exactly where he is already, actually. Well, the sooner you let me in, the sooner Tong can kick me out of here. I got backup and support that nobody else knows about, plus some resources of my own. Your boss can gain from all of this, but only if you let me. Give me a break. I've been on this island long enough to know that Van Bruggen can't get off without Tong's help. See, this is playing into his ego, which I think is good. I've been on this island long enough to know that Van Bruggen can't leave without Tong's help. And I think that's what he wants. Like, he if you, if you, anxious, is this even China or is this Tom Japan? Tong Shaw. I can't remember. I think it's China. Any cheap suckers play like that, are you? Okay, you're right. Yeah, see. Van Bruggen is still in Hengsha. In fact, he came here for help, and we put him somewhere safe. Yeah, see, it's not hard. Now you can leave here with dignity. You know more than you came in with, but just don't let the door hit you in the ass on the way out. Is that actually the end of it? You'll say anything. Get rid of me, won't you? There's no way Tong can hold on to Van Bruggen for long. He'll be dead within a week and Tong with him, unless somebody, namely me, takes that heat off of you and soon. All I need from Van Bruggen is information, the same information his enemies are trying to keep from getting out. So if Tong lets me see him now, in the long run, it'll make Tong's life easier. All I need from Van Bruggen is information. Uh -huh. The same information his enemies are trying to keep from getting out. There's no point in them going after him anymore once he tells me what he knows. So if Tong lets hmm. me see him now, in the long run, it'll make his life easier. You want to bring the Dragon Queen down on your head instead of the Dutchman? <laughs> tickets for that. All right. You can see Tom. Yeah. In his office downstairs. I'll radio the bees to let you through. Don't you do any weird teleportating, teleportating, teleportion stuff, teleportation stuff. Okay. The doors I already act. There should be no way he made it by me. How would you do that? You see this? And to screw it up in the fourth, I'm just flushing my money down the pot. Your tongue. Your tongue. Hey, you only work that out now. Yes. Yeah. You're not as sharp as you think. How about you tell me who you work for? Then I decide what I tell you about Van Bruggen. Does the name Seraph Industries ring any bells? No. Seraph Industries? Isn't that that American company? <laughs> all the headlines a while back? You're still in business? Why wouldn't we be? Check the news. Biotech uh -oh. seem to be failing a lot these days. Especially the way huh. making enhancements. 
Oh, was that me? I flicked the joystick a little bit and changed the camera slightly. Make sure you need him in the same shape you find him. And if I don't, your call. But those implants of yours might look even more special on somebody. Else. <laughs> I like that. That's all you get from me, Laowai. Laowai means white devil or white ghost. Oh yeah? Well, you got anything I can steal from in here? You sure do. Look, I'm just gonna steal from you in front of you. Cause that's just how I roll. Malik, you were right. Tommy is helping Van Bruggen. He stashed him in the Alice Garden pods. Thought as much. A hacker who knows his way around corporate firewalls would make a valuable asset for the triads. I'm at the pods myself, Jensen. Want me to run interference? No. Don't put yourself at risk. Hmm. I'm heading there now. Why is Farida Malik there? That's weird. I don't know why. Now I can go out the front door. We. Oh. Hey, leaving already, tough guy. Cause you might want to go over to the bar and order yourself a drink before you do. Maybe Bobby will have something for you. Bobby, the bartender. The real bartender, that is. <laughs> Thanks. I just might check that out. You do that. Is this the is this Bobby? Is that Bobby? No. Hey, you Bobby? I don't have a name. Okay, so I guess Bobby's upstairs. What does Bob The shit is this guy? <laughs> Sunglasses and black turtlenecks. Oh yeah, that's so hot. You. And again, I know a girl whose like thing is douchebags with tattoos. Once again, personal life stuff. Yay! Where the hell is Bobby? They say the hive serves the best drink in your city. Stay away from the basement. What can I get? There we go. Looks like Tong's running a nice operation here. You for hire? Because a suspicious man might not appreciate you asking. <laughs> a suspicious man might also wonder what kind of job gets handed off to strangers. But all right, I'll bite. What are you offering? I got a problem I need solved. Blow drops. Trouble is, none of my usual guys are available, and this problem. Involves a rumor. Someone who owns hmm. the operation has some money. Getting it out of her is proving to be difficult. It's a dirty job, but it pays well. You interested? Tell me more. <laughs> That's what I like. Of course. This woman, Jaya, she's a broker. Highly competitive field in Heng Shao. Okay. Without the right skills, her business wasn't doing so well. So we helped her out. Gave her a nice social and That's the KC one I haven't bought so yet. Don't need it. Needs. Now, it's time to pay I don't think I'll need it. But she says she won't. So basically you want me to be your collector. Yes. But it's not as simple as that. Uh-huh. Hiding and thinks we won't find her. But she took her phone and computer along to keep her business alive. Not very smart. Assuming you've got the equipment to track those. We don't exist. Exactly. <laughs> know someone who does, and that's where you come in. Val Power set up a surveillance network. Oh, okay, so I hack those, I get the information, and I use that to pinpoint her location. Three relays should be enough for us to access the database and triangulate Jaya's position. I could get four, and you could quadrilate it. Exactly. The first relay is on the rooftop of a four story building in the Yuzao district. Uh huh. I assume you've got an info link and wayfinder package in those fancy orgs of yours. I'll upload the coordinates <laughs> and then contact you once you've hacked in. There we go. Pop! Just punch him in the head knock him out. Hmm, I'm trying to think. Like, there's also another place, like, I want to get a... Can I get one? I'm just thinking about, uh... Van Bruggen. I think I might go back to Van Bruggen's apartment and knock someone out, just because... Uh, something happens, and I want a weapon for it. Fun fact, someone wants a weapon, that's why. 
<laughs> now I'm just thinking where I can go where there'll be a soldier that's not like, you know, too defended. And I think that might be the best spot. Okay. So I'm going to do this side quest first. I'm going to go do that. Then when I get to that point, you'll see. See you there. And boosh. Makes it easier to get around. Okay, relay number one. I see you found the first relay. Now hack it and turn off its security protocols. Yeah, easy peasy, lemon squeezy, buddy. Just like making a wish on the eternal dragon. And there we go. Done. One down, two to go, my friend. I'm not your friend. Stop calling me that. It's not really nice. I don't like it. Oh god, there's there's a. Just <laughs> remembering this thing from uh. What was that show called again? Mad TV. Years ago, years and years and years ago. Uh. Can I float and hack? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. Just extend our legs. Just that's one of the voices is like, I don't wanna. No, I don't wanna. It's just like that's all that's going through my head when I do that voice. Uh huh. Yeah, good luck. <laughs> Yeah, where is it? Over there? How the hell do I get over there? God damn. Canyon Arrow! I don't know why that's been in my head so much lately. It's the Canyon Arrow, the Canyon Arrow theme from uh, The Simpsons. Whoa, Canyon Arrow! Whoa! Whoa! Canyon Arrow! Whoa! Oh, hey, this is for Bell Towers. I can knock out one of these guys quickly and then take the thing. Actually, I might be going in completely wrong area and not even get near the, uh, Dilly. Yeah, I'm, I'm not near it at all. Hey, buddy. I'll take that. Thank you. <laughs> just forget what you're doing like honestly this guy here be like oh my god I really I think that's one of the ah, shit I jumped down too far I think that's one of the things or no I have to go on the other side that's one of the things that people should put in games is like uh, characters reacting to things like if you're doing something like rubbing your junk in their face like I was to Seraph he should be like uh, what are you doing why are you doing that please stop okay how do I get over there I'm over here. And I have to get over there. Oh. Okay. Okay. I think I can get out from over here. From up here. Sprint up the ladder. Sprint up the ladder. I'm mashing the sprint button and nothing is happening. Okay. Ah, there we are. Not easy. Access denied. Damn it. See you in 20 seconds or 30 seconds or whatever. Okay, come on. Let's see if this works. It's this one right here that, like, if it sets it off. Yeah. Oh, I 
This is bad. Oh, come on. Piss. <sighs> Screw it. <laughs> That's Excellent awesome. Work. I'm starting the triangulation now. Should have a location very soon. Got it. <laughs> was, come on, hurry up. And I've got it. Jaya is hiding in an apartment building called the Hengsha Court Gardens in the Yuxia okay. district. I'm sending you her coordinates. Get over there and get us the money she owes. Oh. Huh. Don't see me, don't see me. So I'm gonna go back in here. Works for me. Because I can. That's literally the reason why. Wait. Oh, right, I'm going to go up and take the ladder to, or take the, uh, this path to the ladder, or is this go outside? Damn it, outside. Okay, I'm going to go up, how many? I know it's up a few, I think it's actually up to the top. And then, take a ladder, oh, or to take the, uh, the path in the building and then take the elevator, there we go. <laughs> it was my fault. I did that. Uh, there's one. Just making sure they can't get through it all. No matter what, period, like, end of story, they're stuck. Like, for the rest of their lives, they will live here. No way out. Nowhere to go. And... There we go. See? No, they can't get out. I think maybe they can blow them up with a grenade or something, but... It's a little excessive. You can just live the rest of your life there if they don't find that pathway to get through the, uh... The uh, vent there. Ah, tasty. Um. Okay. Oh. Can I just take the stairs? Because I'd rather just take the stairs. <laughs> it goes white the second I step out of there. Okay. I'll take the elevator. Oh, let me guess. They only, f they only made that one floor. So I could have just gone to that floor through the way I did, and then that would have worked. Maybe. Yep. One floor. Do 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 do. Yeah, I'm sure. That was a really limp sounding throw. Do 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 do. She doesn't know I'm here at all. It's gonna nothing in the toilet still, eh? That's actually how I used to have my bed, basically.
Uh huh. One of Kong's thugs? Well, get out. I told him I won't pay another credit. Okay. Look, I know this is not an ideal situation, <laughs> and I'm not proud that I gotta do this. But Tong's crew wants the money you owe them. Oh, you poor boy. Having trouble dealing with the dirty job you have to do? <laughs> I should feel sorry for you? Reality check, tax man. You're here to steal money from me. What? They got you the augmentation you needed, and they expect you to pay for it. Not the most charitable thing to do, but I would hardly call it stealing. Are you really that gullible? Yeah. It doesn't run a buy now, pay later operation. It's more like a buy now, pay forever. What? Listen, what a dick. I started as a broker. Most other brokers come from rich families. They paid for arguments that give them an incredible edge in the business. There's no way I could afford anything like that through legal channels. So you cut a deal with a crime syndicate. I didn't study this hard to end up with <laughs> Once I made enough money, I offered to pay for the AUG. But no, what they want is part of my monthly profits. That's a dick they move. I'm entitled to it since it's their upgraded enhancement chip that helped me make that money. Well, I can offer help. Listen, maybe I can speak to one of Tom's men. Try and get you off the hook. You would do that? Yeah. I'm awesome that way. Just another one of his mindless thugs. It's hard to properly express what this could mean for me. Don't thank me yet. I can't guarantee they'll listen. But, but I'll try. I'll try. Um, apparently there is a line of dialogue in their world. They'll bring up how she actually used her augmentation on you. Huh, that's weird. They went green the second I stepped in here. Oh, okay, yeah, I can just drop down like this. It works just fine. Where is the vent? Oh, not that one. So, and then the vent should be here. I don't think Bell Tower ever leaves this spot, so you always gotta sneak in, which is bullshit. Okay, well... I think... Before I finish this side quest... I should, uh, call it, though, because it's actually pretty late and i got to exercise still. Wee! Am I going to be dangerous? This way gets me there, too, doesn't it? Or no. I don't know where I'm going, and I don't want to look at the map. Oh, there we go. That's the right way now. Qui-Gon District. Let me through! I think the reward for this side quest is actually a Praxis kit. And I think the cost is also, you know, a Praxis kit. <laughs> like, it's, I'm pretty sure it's a $5,000 to pay off the thing, and then she gives you a Praxis kit. So she basically has enough money to buy this thing herself, but for some reason she doesn't. I really don't know how this world exists. I don't get it. Because I have over 20 grand. And I'm just wandering around aimlessly stealing from people and selling guns I find. But someone can't afford to pay off their little debt. Okay. Wee. Okay. Don't even look at me. Don't even think. Just let me in, you little prick. Cover is essential not only for combat situations, but for stealth, too. Oh. Ah. Okay. There he is. Got a favorite poison? Hey, how about that job? You found Jaya yet? You need to get back the money uh -huh. she owes What's it gonna take for you to leave Jaya alone for good? I don't understand. Didn't you get the money? I know about the Shylock scam you're running. 
Shylock. Get her the augment she wants and then bleed her Isn't that like a for the rest of her X Man? I want to know what it's going to take for you to leave her alone. For good. A cyborg with a heart of gold, are we? <laughs> Tell you what, Guaylo. You give me a year's worth of payments and she's free. 5,000. That's it. kind of man. A fine specimen of humanity. Here's your money. Now you better leave her alone. Go to make threats you can't enforce. But yes. I could kill him right yeah. now and everyone here probably. Oh, see, look at that. So have fun. See? Practice kit. I just paid for a practice point. That's it's, it's, it's just how it is. Like, I now have two. I could get the KC augmentation if I wanted, but I don't really need it. Um, I do keep running out of space often, but I kind of want to jump higher. Take down multiple opponents, see through the walls. Oh, okay. Um. I think I'll work on this one. Look at that. So there's regular just a little tapping and then hold it down. Yeah. Oh, it's great. Look at how high I can jump. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, that's you basically just buy a practice point when you give her the money or give him the money. I thought she gave you the money. I didn't think he gave you the money or gave you the kit. I, I mean, I think she gave. You, I thought she gave you the kit, not him. Ugh, that's what I meant to say. But I think that's it for tonight. Uh, I should have enough for a few days since I won't be uploading for a while still because the internet really shit the bed for no reason at all. Um. But thanks for watching. Toodle pip.